Hey, howdy ho, everybody. This is P with P and K Media, and welcome back to the British Tank Tech Tree Grind series. And uh, sorry for the lack of a series. It's been uh, just over a month ago since the last video, and we've been, you know, I've been grinding it out. If you see some of our other videos, I've been mainly playing as Britain because I've been wanting to unlock more and more tanks for you guys to see us use. And uh, we hope you enjoy today's video. And just to give you a quick little update on what I've been up to. So recently, ooh, didn't even know that was in there. Cool. Um, I have been, obviously, I've got the Chief to Mark 10. Just put that in some videos. Working on the Desert Warrior tree at the moment, as uh, I wanted to use that, get a little missile launching, little toes in the game. So I've had to go back and you know research from the FB405 all the way down to where I'm at right now with the Warrior. And this is the current situation of our tech tree here. And I have obviously one, two, three, four, five six seven eight nine and ten left so and then i've obviously got some premiums to keep this grind going a little bit faster if you see, as you have seen in some of our other videos and just to give everybody a little update if you want to join our war thunder squadron here it is it's the goofy guys as you see we have k in here and our other buddy R, who we record with often, who has not made an appearance in a video in a while. So, we have three out of 128. So, if you uh, want to join, feel free to. You can just hop right in. We'll accept you. So we can uh, get this little community growing. So, without further ado, let's hop into some ground realistic. All right. First match of the day, Domination on Japan. We're going to be bringing out the Roy Cac 105 first. Let's see what kind of shenanigans we can get up to. And, you know, excuse me. And as you've seen, I have put on some smattering of older tanks. I wanted to keep it within the tech tree, so I'm not using just all premiums as we play. Or only using my premiums so I've kind kind of had to align to the chieftain mark 10 is that our as that is our highest non premium main battle tank we have obviously we have the stormer AD but I didn't want to completely get smashed in the mouth this entire uh, recording session so I decided to take it off as the chieftain marksman is still a pretty viable option for anti-air just does not have any rockets unfortunately so let's see if we can find some unlucky person here maybe maybe find an unlucky uh, Russian or German tank maybe a t72 terms or a Panther, or not a panther, a leopard. Whoops. I have a feeling we're gonna find something hiding around here. As that dude just found a BMP3 to the mouth. So he is probably hiding somewhere where I can't see him. And uh, we are already fucking. Fucked up thanks to the old bagel, Beglet Panzer 57. So now we're gonna sit here. Oh, we're not gonna sit here and uh, repair because we're dead. So the German T72, hanging out by the pagoda, decided to come and pay us a visit. <coughs> Excuse me. Now we're going to hop in our Chieftain Mark 10. Let's see if we can't uh, do a number. So 
So my oh nope, that's a BMP three. It was somewhere. Let's just say over there. As they don't show those very small buildings on the map, like I wish they would. Now I've have used this a couple times in our recent videos. Just to get it some stuff unlocked for it, you know, not super heavy, as I say. But enough to where we have some upgrades for it, stuff and things. Not the dart rounds yet though. Those I think I'm rather close if I remember. But nonetheless, we will use it and see what we can do. Now, I prefer the other side of Japan when playing on this map, as I just feel like you get a better view of the map and such. But, that's just me. I know some people like different sides, different spawn points. I just, put, I just go wherever the game puts me and make the best out of shitty situations. So, I'm assuming... Oh, Gooberface McGee over here is. Oh, he is going to capture A. Perfect. As long as we can get some cover from those two guys down around the corner, we should be alright. Sorry about that. Um, also, I wanted to thank everybody for the. Uh, 100, we have just recently passed the 100 subscriber mark. It's been about a month now. And I just want to say thank you to everybody, you know, uh, coming out and supporting the videos. Oh, hold on. Let's see if we can get behind this house. Uh, coming out and supporting the videos, you know, giving it a view, giving it a like, whatever it is. I really appreciate it over here. As you know, we are just a small baby channel. Oh, that did not go the way I wanted it to. And, you know, we're just making just some regular old Goofy War Thunder content for everybody to enjoy. So we appreciate it once again. I know I've said it before, but I will continuously say it again and again because it means a lot. So let's see if we can make some damage with the right cat. At least we did capture Ace, we did get some points, and we did get a kill earlier. So, I'm not holding out too much hope that we can do some damage with this, but this does have the dart rounds. So, uh, we are hoping. So everyone's kind of not wanting to go to B at the moment. So I'm guessing there's some T-72s or something hanging around up there. That we cannot see. Not seeing anything. Some burned out to our right and our left. Lots of more burnt out hulks. So let's try and capture this point. Did KPZ 70 hanging out over there? Is it dead? That's a big motherfucking corpse right there. Jesus. I don't know what that dude was shooting at me for, but let's see if we can't use these buildings to our protection. I am hoping on it. Be able to sneak around off through here. Oh, got a spinny boy. And there he goes. Right through the face with that bard. Get wrecked. You loser! That is another capture point for us. And I don't know, BMP2, I think. No, nope, BMP3. Because normally there is a BMP3, there's a, at least two BMP2s. And. Oh, fuck me. And a cover breach. Oh, 
OF40, so we're gonna go do some business for that guy. Hopefully. Let's see if we can go kill this dude hiding up on the rocks over here that killed our Tam, or that Tam. Yeah, let's see if we go get his ass. Now, I'm not holding out hope because the Tam will punch through our armor and kill us rather quickly because Tams are assholes. Like that. We'll just figure out where he fucked off. Oh, he fucked off. What the hell? Oh, he fucked off behind us. Gave us the old slipperoo. So, looks like they have taken A back, so we're gonna go over there in this slope fucking thing. There's a. What is that? SU 22 or a MIG? Something. I don't know, my identification of Soviet aircraft is kind of shit. Even though I have more Soviet tanks out of everybody I play with. So, I don't know. That's something. If it becomes a problem, I will get in the Chieftain Marksman and we will go handle some business. And make him regret life. We do have two helos. A jet is coming back around. Just spray some stuff at him, cause fuck him. He is using them cannon rounds like a dick. Jabard already took out one of our helos. That's super cool. So you got killed from A, I'm guessing. Where though? Oh. Where are you? You're somewhere over there. Yes, you are somewhere over here, and I will find you. I'm guessing hiding um, somewhere over here. So shots definitely came from right here, unless I'm smoking crack. Yep, he's moving. He's somewhere in front of us. Guessing right there. Thank you. Come again. Stupid ass. All right, let's make our way towards A and see if we can't. Gearabas. That's a bomb? No. It's our <laughs> Israeli A4H. Trying to probably get underneath those other Jabards that that team has. Unless it was just that Jabard that was left. But nonetheless. Since I don't think any, any AA at this BR has rockets yet, unless you have the Jabard A2. Or, oh, the Soviets do, I guess. But I haven't heard any of them clack away yet. So, guns are just as deadly. As most of us know, probably. So, we're going to slowly make our way over here and try and cap A, unless we get sniped from B. Which is completely and utterly possible and might happen. Because, fuck us. So, fuck that house. Yep, there's a, there's one. I hear him in the back somewhere. Where are you? You're somewhere back there. I know you are. Just can't see him yet. He's somewhere back there. I heard him. All four. Yep. He's hiding behind in that village, though. I'm going to keep an eye out up here, though. Just... Just to make sure we don't get flanked again. Like we did by that T-70. I guess we really didn't get flanked. We just kind of got shit on. There he is again. Coming back again for seconds. 
or thirds. Then they have a, I don't know what the fuck, it might be that GR91. Oh, leopard from the hill. Damn, bro got him wedged in that motherfucker. All right, let's hop in our A and see if we can't take out any jets before the game ends. Cause fuck them. Fucker. Oh, what the fuck was that? I hit the wrong button, and now I'm dead. <laughs> and that will not give us enough time. Oh, we might whip in the Vickers. Maybe. Let's see if we can do something with him. It is not like neutral turning. It's not modern enough for neutral turning. Ooh. At least it's faster than the other ones, but not by much. Uh, yeah, I uh, had a joystick plugged in for playing another game, and all my controls got reset, where they have been set for years and years and years, and they're all reset, so now I have to go and fix everything. So it's super freaking great. It's so much fun. I spent a good hour and a half earlier doing that, so always remember, if you're not going to play with joystick, unplug that bitch. And don't be like me. I didn't unplug it because he's an idiot. I'm about to get smacked, maybe, by a jet. More than likely, though, some fuckhead and a leopard. Yes, more than likely, some fuckhead and a leopard. But, I'm just gonna round out this fucking... Ooh! Fuck you! Did that count as a kill? Maybe? Maybe. But... I'm going to reset some more controls and I will see you guys in the next game. Alright, we are back with Belarus. I had to go back and remap a bunch of more controls that I had found. And we did put on the swing fire because I wanted to try it out as I have not tried that out in a battle yet. As the case is with most of our tanks. I have never used half of them just because I was like, eh, it didn't feel like it or just didn't give a shit to try. But... This setup on uh, Belarus sucks balls. Because everyone is still going to go right here for some fucking reason. Because that's where you throw down. That's where you go to party on Belarus. So, they're not going to go there, but they're going to come across that main bridge. So we're going to do some sneaky shit and be a sneaky little bastard. There's a spot you can sit generally right in here. Right in here where you can see. And motherfuckers will come shit whipping to that bridge. Generally right through here. And uh, you'll just end their life. Or if you pull out far enough, you can catch them on the bridge too. But I, I ain't never that lucky, so... Yeah, we are going against America, Germany, and Sweden, so this is going to be fucking fun. Well, we have moved up to the bridge, so... Time to pull forward and see if we can't find someone to shoot. And I'm definitely going to try and stay within the buildings, because... Uh, this thing has no armor because it's, you know, a wheeled infantry fighting vehicle like the Striker. I guess something infantry fighting vehicle, light tank, whatever you want to call it. I don't know. But definitely going to stay within the buildings because the fuck of that shit. What the fuck is going on, people? 
Didn't really need to do that. Fuck the road. I'm gonna go the hard way. Ta-da! Look at that. You still can't fucking drive. What the fuck is going on around here? I certainly have no fucking idea. Oh, chuckle fuck McGee. I can't do what he does because I don't have. Well, that was kind of a. Oh, fucker! Fucking gonna get me killed, bro. And we are going to go. Whoop. Since everyone wants to ram up my ass. Get wrecked. The wolf pack's gonna hit him. There's that other guy, too. Watch. He's. Yup. Told ya. Now, let's see if we can get that wolf pack. No, I'm not. Where the fuck was that from? Oh. Sneaky little bastard. Alright. Chieftain Mark 10, get rid of that. Put the dart rounds on. <sighs> Figured that's how the start was gonna go. Perfect. So, hooray. Let's see if these dart rounds give us any better of a chance to not get shit on. With our incredibly slow tank. So I bet the British, when they looked at this tank, were like, you know what? I will make that thing slow. Because, fuck it. That's why. Fucking low sat. Haven't seen one of those in a while. Damn. Peen Supreme over there. Our homie. Chief to Mark 10. What a G. They did not come the way I thought they would, honestly. There's a bagel panzer rolling around being an absolute dick. Somewhere. I don't know exactly where. But, and the dreaded fucking alpha jet. I wonder when that was going to come out. I figured eventually it was going to come out. Because someone always has a motherfucking alpha jet. Always. Well, now we know where the least degenerate area of the Bagel of Panzer is. But I'm more worried about these dickheads over here. Since our team seems to be Anywhere and nowhere. Everywhere and nowhere. Nowhere relevant, I should say. Can't help that dude out. Would love to, but... MBT-70, somewhere. Don't know where. I don't want to go running out in the open. But a puma needs killing. So we're going to go hunt a puma. Wherever this dickhead is. He's got to be somewhere. Head on a swivel. Uh, this puma can kill us very quickly. MBT-70 from the same fucking spot because no one has killed the dude. So, now we're going to sit in our fucking anti-aircraft gun because we suck. So. Yay. But I don't think we're going to get anything here. 
maybe. No, that's ours. I don't want to shoot down our own plane, as funny as that would fucking be. Get away from the buildings. But, yeah. So I'm going to sit here for the rest of the match until I get smoked by an alpha jet or something. So, we'll see you guys in the next match. Alright everybody, we are back after that last disaster of a round and we are on Sun City. Now this can, map can go one of two different ways I have noticed over the years. Uh, they come and trap you in each spawn and you're fucked. Or you trap them or it's actually, or three I should say. Or it's actually a halfway decent fun map where you actually do things. And get to contribute without getting bitch slapped. No goober ass X and one driving in the middle of the road. Thinks he fucking owns the street because he's made by America. When we are gonna throw the whole kitchen sink at the Germans, the Chinese, or the Swedish. The Swedish. Now is anyone gonna go for B? More than likely, the enemy team will. But we. Well, it's looking like a no from us. So, I'm going to see if I can hold down this main way to get to B and do some right fucking shenanigans. Oh, there's a Khalid. No. CTZ. He disappeared into the fucking over there. Will he show again? I don't know, so I'm gonna shoot now. Where the fuck did he go? Right there. There we go. Through the trees! Into a good old fashioned Leopard 2K from the bridge. Mmm! Perfect. I want to spawn over here again, so maybe we can help with the B point again. Since everyone kind of just went and got bitch slapped today and see. Because, uh, yeah. MBT70, our homie Bet B got murdered by the ZTZ, who I'm guessing is up on top of the bridge now. That's going to be a fucking nightmare to get him off of there. Hooray! My favorite. Trying to get them motherfuckers off that bridge is like worse than getting a tick off a dog. But it is doable. It looks like we got up tiered into oblivion as there is two S3A, T80UD couple of them actually so hooray but we have dart rounds so that should be able to do something yep on top of the bridge called it so he did get killed down the street There he goes. Shooting his ETZ. Damn. Thanks, guys. Damn. For reals, you guys just let them all drive in. It's one of those matches, everybody. Let's get shot in the fucking back. Hooray! My favorite. Our helicopter is not doing a damn thing. And um, T-55 AM-1. AM-1. AMD-1. Maybe he can do something. Nonetheless, we're going to go give him some support. Because by God, he's going to fucking need it. Well, maybe not. 
Have you got one of them? Well, he got fucking both of them. Hell yeah. That's what I like to see, boy. Absolutely smack their ass. You have more armor than me, so you can go first. Let's see if we can go liberate A. Since there are two of them. Oh, one. Don't think he saw me. No, he didn't, and now he's dead. Stupid. Right, let's do a quick drive around while we reload. Help this guy out. I don't know what he's fucking shooting at. What he's scared about. What are you freaking out about, dude? I got your loader. Shoot him! Thank you. You're welcome. Now I'm naked and afraid. And I'm probably going to die. If this guy can't help me repair fast enough. Yeah, yeah. And there's probably another fucking leopard around the corner. Yes, that is a leopard. Guaranteed. Loader, yep. Can't tell if it's an A1, A1 or not. Why are you doing that? Okay. Thanks, teammate behind me. I didn't want to fucking help. Tell you that fucking much. Shit. Alright, Chieftain Mark Free it is. Chieftain Mark Free it is. Let's see how long it takes us to get anywhere. Turn fucking cruise control on. Hooray. Hooray! Cruise control! I hear saving my life. My finger gonna get tired of holding down the fucking button all day. Alright, let's see if anyone's just chilling outside of spawn. Oh! Nuke, baby! Fuck yeah. Yeah, baby, that's what I'm talking about. They have 5,000. I guess no nuke. Weird. Okay. He said, N not today. He's 13 fucking kills and no deaths, so I don't know why he's not bringing a fucking nuke out. Oh, there we go. Figured out the button combo. See if this T62 can draw out. When I sit here, all we know is this game is over. See ya. Drop that nuke. Drop that nuke. Wherever he is. He should be coming in. Yep, yeah, he should be taking off here in a second if you can figure it out. Oh, he is in route. Let's hope he doesn't crash. Let's see if we can. 
see if we can take out this A gun. Wherever he may be hiding. Sound like he's close. Oh, nuke right on my forehead. <laughs> Hell yeah. Beautiful sight to see. All right, everybody. On that note, that will be the end of this video today as we revel in this nuclear bomb that just went off. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, we were thinking about maybe recording some Farming Sim 25 for you guys. It's completely up in the air. If you guys uh, want it or want us to play any other games, uh, leave us a comment down below and we will definitely uh, consider it if you guys put anything down below. So, again, thank you for everything in the recent videos and whether it be supporting them or you're just liking or watching the videos we appreciate it all very much and until next time